Hey YouTube, it's Wednesday, and you know what that means, another tutorial. So today we're doing an old trick called a tipping track. And for this trick you need two Hot Wheels tracks, a billiard ball, a ping pong ball, string and tape, a block that's pretty big, a block that's slightly less big, and about four of these small Jenga blocks, and at least four dominoes. So the first thing you want to do is put this big block in the middle and you're going to have a track on it such that it tilts to one side. But if you look at this, it's too big of an angle, so we're going to provide supports for it. And these supports are the four Jenga blocks. We're going to put one on its side and one laying down like this. And since this track is going to tip, we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So now we've basically provided the layout for our trick. A ping pong ball will roll right here, and a billiard ball will fall on it and roll the other way. Now we need to provide a way for the trick to work, and in order to do that we need to tape everything down. So first we're going to start by taping down the supports. Now that the supports are taped down, we're going to be adding another box for our second track to stand on, and we're just going to use a match box here, and a domino so that it's tilted so that balls will actually roll on it. This is how the ping pong ball and the billiard ball are actually going to get to this track right here. And of course we're going to tape everything down here as well. Now we have a slight problem. And that's that the balls will roll over the track, as you can see right here. So what we're going to do to stop that is to add another stopping block right here and a domino under it because it's not high enough to stop the balls from rolling too far. And we're going to tape that down as well. Now the ball will just roll easily on the track. Now for this purpose we're going to be using the ping pong ball rolling on this first, which then will connect and trigger the billiard ball. So what we need for that is something, namely string, to let go of the billiard ball, which will roll down here. So we're going to connect string to a domino, like this. I'm going to rest the domino here and connect the billiard ball like this and it will be waiting for something to pull out the string and let the billiard ball go. Now all we need is a connecting element and again, just like in the last tutorial, we'll be using dominoes to connect the machine together. Now that we've connected the whole thing together, we should be seeing this ping pong ball rolling on this track to the left here hitting all these dominoes, which is going to pull this string, triggering this ball to roll. It's going to tip this track like this, roll to the right, and hit the other dominoes, and that's going to finish off the idea. So let's see if it works. And that's how to build a tipping track idea. Thanks everyone for watching the video. So I build tutorials every Wednesday and I build other machines whenever I get around to doing that. So I'll be uploading Machine 21 by the middle of November, I hope. It's really hard to make a machine all work in one try, but I'm getting there. So if you like what you see, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.